Welcome back. I am doing my nails today. Now you might be wondering what happened to the last nail video because it's been a while. Okay, so what had happened was this. I made a video where I did my nails, but I just felt like I chatted about just dumb, dumb stuff the whole time. And so I tried to like cut it down and it just got, it just got really weird. And I just, yeah, I kind of scrapped it. Well, then last week I did my nails in some pretty autumnal colors. I did this hand and then I was going to do this hand with another another pattern. Well, I lost the first clip to doing my left hand and then doing my right hand took so long because I'm right-handed. So using my non-dominant hand and doing nail art took so long. My memory card was full. My battery died. And at the end of it, I was just like, you know what? Fuh. I had to get it done. We were going out to dinner. I had to, I had just had to do it and it was, it was done. So now what we're going to do is my nails now. And I'm going to for sure fast forward this point because we're just doing, you know what? I'm just going to turn it off and I'll come back when I've got my base coat. All right, so I've got my base coat on. What I'm going to do is I'm going to do some autumnal nails. I'm going to kind of maybe recreate a little bit what I did um, on my left hand last week, but maybe simplified a little bit. So I'm just going to give these, and yeah, I'm using my little, my little a stripper polish. It's striping polish, but I'm just going to call it stripper because I'm a silly. And I like these um, polishes because they're kind of like this jelly consistency. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to put down a little, a little yeller first. And I'm just going to do it in the middle because I'm going to kind of flare this out with orange on the sides. It's going to be pretty. Trust, trust me, trust my process. Just trust, just trust. I'm listening to um, Simply Nail Logical in the background. She's, this is um, a few weeks ago, she did something on, on the blackest black paint color. And um, I think, I predict within a year, she's gonna have the blackest black nail polish color. I bet that she's working on it right now. I have no doubt. Um, I just painted my hair into my nails. Ah. I like um, her. She's kind of pivoted to mostly streaming and less nail art. She did a thing where she said she's not a YouTuber anymore. I know if this comes off frame, I'm, I gotta do it. I gotta do the art too. So I've got a little yellow going down. Just trust me. Are y'all with me still? I hope everybody's still with me. Don't worry about it. Don't worry about this guys. It's gonna be great. It's gonna be a moshing. So I like saying the word amazing. Amazing. I'm inspired by Penny from Happy Endings. I think that she's hilarious. Can't remember her name. What's her name? Casey, Casey. It's not Casp. I think Casp is like her, her husband's last name, but I am, yeah, I can't remember her last name. Wilson. Got it. Don't you love that when you can't remember something and then it just comes to you while you're still trying to think about it? That's um, nice. So I'm going to come in while this is still actually in the wet, maybe. Trust me, it's 
gonna be really great. It's gonna look maybe like fire a little bit. And this is my nail that grows really, it kind of grows out like it curves down on the side. And my hair is gonna get in the shot. It's trying. My hair is like the, the kid who's not getting the attention. So now what I'm going to do, back to yeller. So it's kind of like a little um, muddled, muddled, muddled. But it's gonna be all right, cause it's gonna look up her day in the end. Trust. And so I'm trying to also like maybe uh, not marble it, but like blend it in and kind of stripe it in. It's gonna look like leaves when I'm done. And you know how like when le the leaves change, they're like. Red and yellow and orange all mixing in together. That's what we're doing. Okay. It looks like fire, too. I like that. Fire! But yeah, now I want this um, carbon black stuff for my nails. Be like you just didn't have no nails. Well, I mean, you still have them. Okay, so we're gonna feather, feather here. Just gonna feather it. I think it's pretty. I'm real happy with it. I'm gonna try this one. I'm doing the, the um, well, I already did a little bit, but I'm gonna come in and do the, the kind of darker orangey. who knew Nish Kapoor is, but he is not popular with this person who, who um, wrote this article or made this paint. I mean, this is intense. This is like, this is awesome drama. I'm going to have to see if hobby drama has a write up on this. I am a huge fan of the hobby drama subreddit. I don't participate there or anything. But I love to read about just random hobby drama. I think everybody does. It's going really good. Okay, this is gonna be awesome. Just wait, just wait, just wait until I get, I'm gonna let this dry a little bit before I go in with my nail art.
So I'll be right back. Okay, so now what we're gonna do is we're gonna come in and I'm gonna make little the veins of the leaf. I know that this looks just I know it looks a little rudimentary, but It's all right. I don't have the stamps. And, but I do have this contraption that I created. It's a little, it's an old nail polish brush, clearly. And I have just taken off every, every little brush head except for this one. So there, I've got my little leaf here. I'm gonna have to put more of the green down. This stuff dries so quick. It dries super quick. Like it's already, it's already done. And I just dip my brush into a little acetone. And It helps to like thin it just a little bit, so makes it a little bit more workable. I'd love to be able to do like a little, a more intricate kind of leaf design, but this is, this is about as um, detailed as I can get. And it's gonna be a little abstract for sure. But, I'm still, I still like how it ends up looking. Okay, so that's another little leaf on this one happy get more I know that this almost looks black on on the screen but it's just a dark 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 green Are we happy with it? I hope everybody's liking it. Hope um, we've got some good plans for Thanksgiving. Our daughter has to work, unfortunately. But that's okay, because we'll just get together another day. My first job, I worked at a newspaper. And I was like the weekend and holiday copywriter. And so, at 17, I was having to go to work on the holidays. And so I'm like, I always understand when somebody's like, I don't have to work on the holiday. It's not fair, it's not fair, I know. I've got more fuzzies now. Look at that. That was terrible. You can't fade with a fuzzy.
purchasing this item on behalf of a mutual or, or an associate. Oh my god, what happens if someone like gave it to a niche care for? Like what would happen? I kind of wanna know. I feel like if somebody gave this paint to Anish Kapoor, Anish Kapoor would immediately evaporate into the ether. And it's one of those details like nobody else is going to see this up close except for me well and anybody who watches this which I appreciate you being here thank you for watching but so this is the kind of thing that really is you know if you're doing it it's it, it really is going to just be for you because people may or may not you know get up and get up close and look at it and that's fine But the thing I love about um, Christine with Neological, because she's become kind of more of a chatty channel, and I love it because she's just she's so sweet, and she just like anything she talks about, she gives people like the benefit of the doubt. Like I don't know if anyone has ever had beef with this woman, but you're wrong. If you, if anyone is arguing with this woman, like you're wrong. You just are. Like she's just so sweet, and she's entirely reasonable about and anything she's entirely reasonable about literally anything she says and I feel like yeah she's she's for sure correct on this so yeah if, if you got beef it got bad blood with a nail logical then the, there there's something wrong with you <laughs> all right so I'm liking this oh, it's so pretty I'm gonna do something else though this is where we're gonna um, stuff it up. We're gonna stuff it the heck up with some shimmer. We're gonna put a little shimmer on the nails. Oh, I've got another shimmer I'm gonna do too. Oh, I didn't even grab this and I meant to. It's a green, I know. Surprise, surprise. I'm gonna put a little of that down. I'm gonna put a little of this down. Yay! And then I'm gonna come in. I probably want more than this. Just adding some little highlights and shimmery accents. You know, I'm just gonna, ugh, I'm gonna make it, this is gonna be bad. Yeah, this is fine. Let me get in here and get some little orangey shimmers.
like the metallic kind of accenting the whole thing because it's just feeling real subtle but from my angle it feels subtle but it looks and it's making an impact I wish that I thought about this and I could have like maybe tried to make you know what don't get too complicated Stephanie per Per Stephanie, don't get too complicated. What, you know what, and even Avril asked, why do you have to make things so complicated? Because I just feel like art is complicated. It's not though, is it? Tell me in the comments. Is it complicated or no? All right, so the next thing we're gonna do, I'm gonna put on a top coat and we'll do some close-ups and see how pretty it is. All right, so I'm doing the leaf on my other hand and I am all right with how it's going. And it very, it's very abstract, which I feel like if you're working with your non-dominant hand doing something, that's, um, you know, it's okay. And again, we're talking my tiny little fingernails and whatever happens on them, it's, it's not the end of the world. It's, this is not gonna, you know, I'm not gonna save the world. I'm not gonna <laughs> destroy anything with my little bit of, you know, abstract leaf nail art. So it's just making me happy. And I hope that if you're watching it, it makes you happy too. Christine is still, she hasn't painted anything yet with the, 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 the black. And it's so funny. She's just having like fit after fit. Cause I can understand like, if it's, if it is like, it's, you can just use it wherever you want. Right. But no. I think non-toxic's like a, yeah, marketing term. I don't think it's actually a, I don't know. I don't think it's a scientific term. Because anything's toxic after a while. I mean, and or in great, great enough quantities or used improperly. Water is toxic if you, you know. You drink too much of it or if you're under water yeah she's very quebecois all right so i've done the orange kind of shimmery highlight we'll do a little bit of the green shimmery highlight i put some down with it it dried up immediately but this is nice i like this i think it's pretty i'll have to check with my husband and see if he likes it too he i know it sounds weird but it's not weird he likes my nails painted pretty and i think that that's a really sweet thing for him to support that if I want to do my nails and do something artistic on them, he just is real nice about, you know, telling me it looks pretty and that he likes it and stuff. So, yeah, I think I'm pretty lucky. I'm pretty lucky that I'm, that I've got the husband I have. He's um, very loving, very sweet, and I really appreciate him. We went out for a date night the other night, and that was so much fun. Although, I almost had a fit. We got to the restaurant, and they wanted to set us at the very back, like, almost in the little, like, hallway going to the bathrooms. And I was like, oh, no, I'm not sitting here. And 
I could tell he was like, Ugh. and I was, I mean, I'm not trying to be mean or rude, but I don't want to sit almost in the bathroom at a nice restaurant where, you know, we're going to spend a, you know, a decent amount of money. to wait a little bit longer because the next thing they offered us was the table like right beside the kitchen where they're like bussing tables and I'm like no 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 we don't I just want to sit like in a nice part of the restaurant I'm sorry I don't think a restaurant should have like good tables and bad tables but they do I mean they just do so we got a table that was good, and we enjoyed our dinner. I had a, a filet. My husband had the porterhouse. He wanted the tomahawk, but that was, that's kind of a, that's a little bit more. It was not a special occasion, this, this date. So let's hold off on the the um, let's take that. Okay, alrighty. So I think I'm good. I'm gonna do a top coat and then we'll come back and do a final look. All right. So I am done. I have painted them. I'm gonna see if I can't zoom in. And I'm gonna have to refocus. How pretty is that? So they're like little fall nails with a little bit of green highlight and a little bit of autumnal orange highlights. And I think that they're pretty and I'm happy with them. So let me know if you like them too. And this week I am doing my new moon journal over on my journaling channel, Steph LJ, and I will probably be doing fun lunar inspired nails for that channel too. So here we are. Ah, I love it. So check me out over on Steph LJ. Subscribe here per, for per Stephanie nails and chit chat. And I hope you have a great Thanksgiving and I will see you later. Bye.